Shalom, brothers and sisters. Shalom. So they tell me that not to cast your pearls to the pigs, not to throw your pearls out there for the pigs to eat up and devour. Because once you feed the hogs your pearls, hey, that, them hogs are nasty, filthy, disgusting animals. They eat their babies. They eat rotten stuff. They are uh, very sick. Do a lot of nasty things. Pigs. Very nasty creatures. Nasty, unclean animals. Filthy. Now, whenever you cast your pearls to the pigs, hey, they eat it up real fast, eat bones and all. They leave nothing behind. So they eat up your pearls that you cast there for them, and then they turn around and come after you. Yeah, they, they want to eat you up. You don't want to cast your pearls to the hogs out there in the mud and the muck. They like to roll around and get all muddy and nasty and mucky. Don't want to throw your pearls out there for them. Some people don't know right from wrong. Just like those hogs, pigs over there. They don't know what's clean and unclean. They don't know. Hey, but if you know what's clean and unclean, then you don't want to touch the unclean thing. You don't want to throw your pearls to something that is unclean because you don't know what's right from wrong it's not hardly worth casting your pearls to the swine it's not hardly worth it just uh, keep your pearls to yourself don't cast them to the swine because after they eat up your pearls they're coming after you for some more of your pearls. Don't touch nothing that is unclean. Keep a clean spirit. Don't get your spirit all muddied up with uncleanness from the hogs. You never want to throw your pearls to them filthy, disgusting hogs. Don't do it. Keep your pearls to yourself. Don't let the hogs have them. Keep them pearls away from them pigs. They're nasty, disgusting creatures. Very unclean. Shalom. Shalom.